Hey YouTube and uh, welcome back to the channel. This is my uh, on the range toolkit. This little pouch has all the, to all the tools that I am likely to need on the range. So let's get into it. Uh, the pouch itself is, I think I got it in some sort of subscription box. It's just a generic uh, Molly, a Molly capable pouch with the zippers that go all the way around so that you can open it uh, fully up like a book. And it's got a, it's got a placement for a morale pouch in the front. If I need this, well then I need to embrace the suck. And in the front pocket here, I've got uh, two pairs of vinyl gloves. So let's get into it. I'm going to start on my right and move towards the left. So here we've got a um, a Vortex branded uh, lens pen. So this is both a little brush and a um, tool to uh, clean your uh, your lenses off your you know. Uh, of any optic that you may bring with you. In addition to that, I always bring a lens cloth, but this is nice to get into the tight corners. In the back here, I've got batteries, specifically CR2032s, which are the batteries that most of my optics use. Next is another Vortex branded tool. This is a Vortex uh, red dot adjustment tool came with one of the Vortex Red Dots I have. And then there is a 2.5mm uh, uh, and, and or 330 seconds punch. Very, very useful that. Over on the left hand side, we get a lot more tools. So this, this is Fix-It Sticks. Um, I backed the Kickstarter back in 2016 and I've been so impressed with the toolkit I got back then that when I was building this kit, well, this was easy. This is their replaceable version, shooting and hunting edition with a bracket. And so it comes with these two fix-it sticks as they're called. And uh, you simply fit them like so, and there you go, you've got a uh, you've got a bit driver, which you can actually really torque down on. It comes in this uh, bracket and it includes 16 different bits. There are, let's see, 2.5mm, two, two 3mm, 4mm and 5mm uh, Allen key, as well as an eighth inch, 5 seconds, 5 30 seconds, uh, 3 16th uh, inch Allen key. In addition, there are Torx bits uh, from 10 through 30, a slotted number 5 and a number 1 Phillips set. This is very useful um, and this covers all of my needs. In addition, I picked up this guy, which is a Fix-It Sticks all-in-one Torx driver, which ranges from 15 through 65 inch pounds. Um, so the way this works is you put a bit driver on this end, a bit in this end, and you uh, torque on it, and then you simply read off the scale here, how much torque you've applied. It works very well and does exactly what I needed to. Then there are my odds and ends tools. This is a Tapco uh, rifle chamber flag which is useful as a pin driver and you know having a chamber flag is never a bad idea. Next we've got uh, an allen key of some size I'm not sure this is the one that came with the stock for my uh, uh, for my shotgun and finally I have the crudest tool in uh, of the bunch a non-marring hammer so this guy used to be the mallet for a uh, fire alarm. Uh, the fire alarm was taken out of service and I picked up the mallet. I then mounted it in a um, 
spent 243 uh, Winchester casing. I mounted it with Sugru here on the handland, and as and I also added Sugru to the end, which just gives me a really nice little thwacker. Very nice, just really works very nicely. And then in the back here, I've got Ballastol wipes. Um, you know, different strokes for different folks. For field maintenance, a Ballastol wipe just really does what I needed to do. Um, and what I like about this kit is the fact that it really just does everything I needed to do. This is something that I can just dump in my range bag, in my backpack, whatever, and just know that I've got the bits that I need. So that is very, very useful. That's it for this time around. Hope you all are, I hope you all are keeping safe. Until the next time.